catchy and extremely strong and they're competing equally this weekend. International pole dancers will be descending on the Sussex Town for the World Championships. Men as well as women. 26 countries competing in the event which is being hosted in the UK for the first time. The organisers say they want to move the image of pole dancing away from strip clubs to a more athletic show of strength and skill. Juliet Parkin reports. <laughs> Some have come from as far as Russia for world pole dance. Today, the knockout rounds ahead of tomorrow's final. A barn in Surrey, the somewhat surprising location for an international competition, but all judged in strict accordance with pole dance rules. It's a sport that's become a global sensation. I think uh, nowadays it's uh, very popular and it's uh, an uh, important kind of sport in Russia. It makes me feel powerful and graceful and it's bring joy and it's, it's really good. Each performance is about showing off strength, skill, stamina and choreography and sometimes costumes are judged too. More than anything, it's about getting away from the strip club stereotype, famously portrayed by Demi Moore in the late 90s film Strip Tease. My main aim was to get it from the gentlemen's clubs into a theatre, onto a world stage. Those that are privileged to see it on Saturday will make their own minds up. With stereotypes and it tends to be slightly older people that you know haven't had the education of it and of course if I was an old grandma and I've never seen it I would assume that too it's it's not people being rude or anything it's just lack of education with the new kind of sport we've made out of it and it's not just for women more and more men are taking to the pole and will be competing in Sussex this weekend there is a fitness and sports side to it and there's also that you know, the erotic side, which is still there. There are two different things. Um, I respect all sides of pole. To me, it's all an art. It's, it's a majority, it's 95% sort of women uh, in the actual industry. But um, yeah, there is a lot more guys taking up now, and it's really good to see that. There are now calls for pole dancing as a sport to be included in the Olympic Games. Poles apart from where it began. Juliet Parkin, BBC Southeast Today, near Crawley. Oh,